do it yourself. Ways to lower your electric bill. Do you want to lower your electric bill? With the rising cost of electricity, finding ways to save money on energy costs is becoming increasingly important and harder. Fortunately, some simple and effective strategies can help you reduce your electric bill. In this video, we'll share 15 ways to lower your electric bill. We will also provide tips for reducing energy usage in your home. How much energy does the average home use? The typical American household now uses 11,000 kilowatt hours of electricity annually, which is a 13-fold increase from 1950. The average annual cost of electricity in the United States is between $1,500 and $2,000. What is worse is that energy prices continue to increase, so your electric bill will only go up. That is unless you follow the recommendations in this video. Reducing electricity consumption at home is a great way to save money and help the environment. Here are 15 simple steps you can take today to reduce your electricity usage. The first way to save on electricity is to perform an energy audit. An energy audit verifies, monitors, and analyzes your energy usage. It identifies opportunities for energy conservation and cost savings. An energy audit typically involves inspecting your home's insulation, windows, doors, lighting systems, heating and cooling systems, and other equipment to determine how efficiently they operate. The auditor may also review utility bills to identify areas where energy use can be reduced. The audit also identifies the type of fuel used for heating and cooling, the age of the equipment, and any recent changes in the building's occupancy or operations that may have affected its energy consumption. Once you have collected this data, you can use it to develop an action plan for improving your home's efficiency. Pro tip. You can often get a discount from your utility companies to have an audit performed. So reach out to them to save even more. The next way to save on electricity bills is to kill energy vampires. An energy vampire is an appliance that draws electricity when it isn't used. Even when a device is turned off, it can still draw power when it is plugged in. Make sure to unplug any appliances you're not using, such as TVs, computers, or microwaves. Minimizing energy vampires by unplugging unused electronics and appliances can reduce your energy consumption by up to 10%. Speaking of energy vampires, the next tip is to use power strips. Using a power strip reduces your electricity usage Many people use them to protect their electronic devices, but they can also be helpful to use less electricity. By using a power strip, you have a switch to just flip off several energy vampires at once. Easy! The fourth way to save on electricity may lead to the most savings. Four, use energy efficient light bulbs. Lighting makes up roughly 15% of a typical home's electricity consumption, and switching to LED lighting can result in annual energy savings of more than $225 for the typical household. LED bulbs are becoming increasingly popular due to their energy efficiency and long lifespan. LED bulbs use up to 85% less energy than traditional incandescent bulbs, making them an excellent choice for reducing electricity bills. Each LED bulb saves around $1 to $2 per month in electricity costs. The average home has about 40 light bulbs, so switching to LED bulbs can lower your electric bill significantly. In addition to the monthly cost savings, LED bulbs last much longer than traditional bulbs, up to 25 times longer. This means you won't have to replace your bulbs as often, saving you time and money in the long run. LEDs also produce less heat than other types of lighting, which can help reduce air conditioning costs in the summer months. And because they don't contain hazardous materials like mercury or lead, they're much better for the environment. Overall, LED bulbs offer a great way to save money on electricity bills while helping protect the environment. If there is only one thing on this list you do, I would recommend switching all of your light bulbs to LED. If there are only two things you do, they 
Prepare to light this video right now and use LED bulbs. Our next tip is to turn off lights. Having LED bulbs is great. We have them. But turning your lights off when you're not using them is low-hanging fruit to shave your electric bill. Better yet, use natural lighting to brighten up your rooms. But more importantly, just remember to turn off the lights when you leave a room. Number six on our list of 15 ways to save on electricity is to install a programmable thermostat. The majority of us spend the day at work. There is no need to heat or cool the house to a comfortable level when no one is home. That means you can adjust before work and even while you sleep. Many people can do this manually, but having a programmable thermostat can automate the process and even let you control the temperature from your smartphone. In our house, we use Alexa for our thermostat. Our next energy saving tip is to use cold water for laundry. Washing clothes in cold water instead of hot can save up to 90% of the energy used for each load of laundry. Next up, invest in energy efficient appliances to lower your electricity bills. When shopping for new appliances, look for ones certified as energy efficient by the Energy Star label or other standards organizations like the Consortium for Energy Efficiency. These appliances will use less electricity than standard models and save you money on utility bills over time. I did an energy audit on our freezer chest and discovered that replacing it with an Energy Star freezer would pay for itself within a few years. The older your current appliances, the more dramatic the energy savings can be. Another way to lower your electric bill is to air dry your dishes. Dishes are frequently placed in the dishwasher and then dried thoroughly using the heat drying feature. Why not just air dry your dishes instead? It is as easy as opening the washer door and letting after the cleaning cycle, then just let it air dry overnight. We do this every night. The typical power consumption of dishwashers is 1,800 watts. The cost of power in the US is approximately 13 cents per kilowatt hour. So if you run your dishwasher for an hour five days a week, it will only run you about $6 each month. This is a little, but it all adds up. While technology is excellent for many things, air drying your dishes is an excellent method to save money. Pro tip, cleaning your dishwasher also improves its efficiency. We just recommended air drying dishes. Air drying your laundry is also a great way to slash your electric bill. Did you know that a typical clothes dryer uses between 1,800 and 5,000 watts of power each time it is used? Have you ever considered simply letting them dry outside? You will not only save money by not using a dryer, but you will also avoid purchasing a dryer if you can take your clothing and hang it outside. Next on our list is to take a shorter shower. People love their showers. The flowing hot water and rising steam can leave you feeling relaxed and satisfied inside. But are long, super hot showers necessary? Personally, I think so. But the point of this video is to help you save money. A short, cold shower can save you big bucks on your energy bill. Water heating is the second largest household energy expense. It takes up 18% of the energy bill for homes. Many finance gurus on Twitter joke about taking cold showers to save money. The savings are no laughing matter though. If you can take shorter cold showers, you can dramatically reduce your water and energy bills. The next time you're tempted to take a long, hot shower, consider cutting it short and turning down the temperature. Doing so can help you save money in the long run. Earlier, we recommended doing an audit to find leaks. Next on our list of 15 ways to save money on electricity is to fix those air leaks. Leaks cause your heating and cooling system to work harder to maintain the desired temperature. Also, air leaks can cause drafts, making it feel colder than it actually is, leading you to turn up the thermostat even more. To reduce air leaks and lower your electric bills, start by inspecting the exterior of your home for any visible gaps or cracks. If you find any, seal them with caulk or weather stripping. Check for any air ducts that may be leaking air from inside your home. If you find any holes or cracks in the ducts, 
Seal them with duct tape or metal foil tape. Doing this will help ensure that all of the heated or cooled air stays inside your home instead of escaping through the ducts. We are up to number 13 of our 15 recommendations to lower your energy bill. Invest in solar panels. We have solar panels in our house, so our money is where our mouth is. It is costly, but if you plan to be in your house for a while, it is worth it. Ask your salesperson to provide the break-even date to you, then decide if you think you will live in the house that long. Although the upfront costs may seem crazy, the long-term savings and environmental benefits make it well worth considering as an alternative source of electricity. We also know this isn't an easy do-it-yourself project, but we feel it belongs on the list. Number 14 is so easy. It is just to ask for a discount. People love getting discounts and sales on items. Did you know that some utility companies offer discounts? It is always a good idea to ask your utility company if there are any discounts or incentives. There usually are. The final recommendation to lower your electricity bill is to decrease the temperature of your water. The typical setting for water heaters is 140 degrees Fahrenheit. A temperature reduction to 120 degrees Fahrenheit can result in a 10% reduction in energy expenses. Also, don't forget to set the thermostat on your water heater to the lowest level while you are away from home to avoid wasting electricity. Obviously, this only works if you have an electric water heater. And there you have it. 15 ways that you can reduce your monthly electric bill. None of them are difficult. If you like finding ways to waste less time and money on things, be sure to subscribe to our channel and like this video 